Alright guys, so I've been uh, plowing through this traffic for a couple miles now. It's almost stopped. It's actually moving a little better than it was back there. But I pulled over to the side of the highway because I had my camera in my pocket. I wanted to turn it on so y'all could see the center laning is all about. Now, California motorcycles have the ability to center lane and so we're fortunate enough to be able to get through a lot of this stuff but there's an art to it and if you're not comfortable doing it don't do it so first thing is don't go too fast a lot of guys really plow through here and just not prepared to stop for everything. Uh, secondly, just assume that everybody's going to kill you and pull out to the lane. There's only so much you can do. You got to put some blind faith into it. But that's what it is. And uh, so I've been. Uh, motorcycle messenger for a lot of years might have mentioned that before somebody you guys know that uh, I have a lot of experience and I commute every day to work pretty much by motorcycles I got a lot of experience doing this now this is a Saturday afternoon so that is actually really rare that it's like this so there must have been some game or accident or something that created the situation. And we may find out up ahead, oh, this Mercedes, what are you gonna do? Oh, crazy blonde lady. Uh, the, the downside of this is that people who, the drivers, when they commute during the week, they generally are aware of the motorcycles. And, oh, thank you very much. Uh, and, you know, they're used to it. Uh, these guys are all weekenders. And who knows where they're coming and going, but they don't drive this route every day. So I gotta be a little more careful of this type of driver. doing about 30 miles an hour, traffic's rolling about 15. Uh, in California, it's called lane sharing, and the deal is you can share a lane, but you can't pass cars faster than 15 miles an hour than the speed they're doing. Um, greater than 15 miles an hour from the speed they're doing. What Uh, you know, while I, I, I don't always, I don't always uh, adhere to that rule, but, you know, yeah, there's really no point in going faster, and when I've seen, uh, when I've seen other people doing this much faster, it makes me cringe and I, I really won't go too much faster than what I'm doing now relative to the other traffic. Uh, looks like we have a concert going on at Shoreline Amphitheater and with all those cars over to the right we can exit. That's probably the cause of all this. So probably going to open up a little bit now. I wish you'd been back there. I've been uh, plowing through that stuff for well, let's see, it's probably been like five miles going slow. Finally, it was enough that I stopped to check it out. But... Well, what you gonna do? Oh, also, uh, one of the fun things about center laning here is see this little ridge that we just crossed where it goes from concrete to uh, pavement. And uh, if you watch carefully back there a little bit, you'll see uh, all these big open uh, gaping potholes that develop in that spot. So nice to have the Enduro to be able to 
bounce through that stuff if you do get something. And anyway, that's a little bit of center lane in California. There'll probably be a few more of those videos, I'm sure. And eventually, uh, maybe even do a little tutorial on the ins and outs of all that. So, hope you enjoyed that. Have a great time. Uh, thank you.